and welcome ladies and gentlemen to back to life a new show where we focus on all types of visual art forms now i'm here with aditya mohan believe it or not he is my coo of this company and he's one hell of a cinematographer and you know what i'm just i'm not going to do the, i'm not going to do his explaining for him i'm going to ask him to introduce himself and then we're going to ask a couple of questions how about that okay so uh, go ahead aditya introduce yourself well uh, firstly thank you madhav for giving me this stage and uh, i'm so happy now i'm associated with throwdown media and yeah so basically i'm a filmmaker photographer uh dp director of photography writer and i mean yeah and then there are some secret stuff i don't want to tell about i have worked like i think i worked for like probably 10 years or something but i'm not sure really that's a that's a long time it is it is it is so aditya so how did it all start how what got you into this field uh like of using a camera and just going wild with your imagination well actually i wasn't bitten into this bug but i was bitten like no i mean like i would just say i was just put on to it by a very you know a uh, special person in my life so it's like so i'll tell you what what happened the entire story no issues okay Go for it. um So I think I was in sixth grade and we had like this, you know. Um, so our school, Indian High School, shout out to Indian High School, uh, in Dubai, guys, please, go great freaking school, okay. I mean, this is not a paid promotion, okay. I <laughs> know it's not. It's actually not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So uh, they used to take us on field trips, okay, and then one field trip was to uh, Delhi, the capital of our country. and also to agra and my aunt was like okay you're going you're going to have fun you're going to make a lot of memories just take the camera go and priya that's i just went took her camera literally it was an xs i believe canon xs it's that point and shoot camera right yeah yeah, 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 point yeah, and yeah. Shoot, small yeah. one small, small little one it's like one of those digital cameras that uh uncles will take on vacations you know like yeah i mean like if you have seen dil dhadakne do you might uh, yes that i know that that's <laughs> that <laughs> that's that <laughs> tiny ass camera yeah that's yeah. yeah so so basically i got that and i was just going wild with it because i was just like what is this cool thing cool feature and i was like just taking every little random photo but i mean like i used to photograph my food i used to photograph my feet i used to photograph the plane i used to photograph like just guys going on the plane i used to photograph like people just looking at taj mahal and all simply you didn't photograph the taj mahal but you photographed people photographing or looking at the taj mahal yeah okay then okay okay uh so then uh, like you know so in that way like it was like very interesting for me that phase and then you know i came back i showed those photos to my aunt my aunt okay she kept it with her she wanted to give me a copy later on she's like you go to school and come back and pick it up one day when you're on the way back home so then what happened was uh then after that my un- she showed it to my uncle okay so my uncle's like oh interesting and my uncle's like he was he used to travel a lot because of his job okay and he had like a really very 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 good job okay and uh, then he had all this nat geo stuff and all and he was and he used to use like believe it or not the uh, this thing yellow pages and all that like that there used to be one uh, lonely planet he used to have lonely planet books i i do i do remember those yeah yeah blue color ones yeah that one yeah, yeah so he had of like each country or kind of like that like collection of lonely planet that's a that's a that's a that's not just a lot of books it's like a big stack of them that's yeah. that's big that's a lot of them yeah, yeah 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 that's like so uh so he saw the photos and he found some few odd looking good diamonds in the rough types and then believe it or not he called me one day he called me home he's like i want to take you somewhere come home i went to his place and then 
uncle took me took me to sharaf dg okay the one of the biggest electronics retailers in yeah. dubai and then what had happened was uh, i liked a fuji film point and shoot now what can i say fuji films are that good okay especially the film semi uh, simu- emulation or whatever it is like those days they just had like normal generic presets but it used to look good like it's just like film look it'll come in and fuji film my god that's like amazing camera so he bought that camera okay and he told me i'm going to give it to my uh, friend's son my birthday comes around the corner ta ta and that camera is on your desk no it's i literally open it as a birthday gift it's mine and it's that camera you didn't know it was that camera no no i didn't i didn't even expect it like literally i didn't you expect you thought he was buying it for somebody else exactly okay then all right that's that's wow it's like a wonderful way to actually um give somebody a gift that's like a wonderful way to surprise someone actually go ahead <laughs> and then from there the bug was bitten and i just started on to this creative journey like that transpired about to like which led to the culmination of this and that's where you are right now yes okay let's talk about your portfolio how many short films have we done <coughs> well short films uh number i'd say You want to know the official released one or the? How many have you shot, regardless of release, whether you released it or not? I'd say about like some twenty, twenty-five. That's 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 a, that's, a, that's a lot. So that's twenty to twenty-five short films that you shot, which are either released or not. Yeah, but most of them were like not short films actually. They just like so I used to just like simply I'll just. take my camera point anything at it and just shoot i'll shoot my balcony i'll shoot my coffee mugs i love my coffee mugs i'm a die hard coffee guy i can see that yes and by just uh, by your habits around the office i do I, yeah. that's true so that's uh, very true so anyways one more thing i want to ask you is yeah what was your first proper videography project that uh, first proper yeah, video that, that you actually did your first one your first video gig okay so it was not like gig gig but then thing is see i went on this project uh, project is a better word for yeah, that yeah it's like a project which i gave for myself kind of like a that kind of yeah it doesn't like, matter who gave it to you yeah you so um so you know like uh, so there's uh, there's this beautiful portrait photographer he's like a mentor of mine his name is subodh shetty okay and he's in dubai he runs this uh, he's a, he basically is the founder of this community called photo walk dubai and photo walk connect and yeah. uh, we all like travel along with him so, and he takes us on these tours and travels uh, and we ended up stumbling to one place called himachal pradesh okay so i wanted to go on this i know he and he's a like really he's an econ ambassador also and he's very great at his craft believe it or not and i uh, had soft time honestly so um then what happened was uh, so i went on hopped on with him and then like i saw how he was working and did everything and you know like and then like see i wanted to do video at that time like proper travel video so then like i was like okay i'm going to make this coolest travel video and that trip was sponsored by nikon shout out to nikon middle east uh, mea So uh so yeah we got the equipment from Nikon we jumped on the plane we went to Himachal and I'm like let, let me start shooting and I just started taking random videos of the entire place and then the next thing you know it that gets a platform So you're telling me Nikon basically not only paid for your No they didn't pay for the trip but they paid for the equipment Oh they just gave the equipment off Yeah So they were straight up sponsoring the equipment for. Yeah, the it's like a technical sponsorship. Ah, okay, okay. That, you get my mind. That's cool. So like we don't have any of those here for some reason. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, like I know these people should get onto this boat over here. I mean, like the the, the way I see it is, there's so many extremely talented camera folks. Yeah, camera exactly. Like operators, whether it be photographers or videographers. Not even like you know. 
see there's so many of them here yeah exactly and you know what's the what's my gripe about it is like see you're you're not going to lose anything over a day right and yeah. your day can count a lot it can do a lot of things it can teach you a lot of things so then like just give it to them for a day or maybe for a week okay and then like let them see what they can do with it they'll they'll make their own stories their own beautiful small stories in this world and that's what mm-hmm. matters in the end yeah exactly and see you know uh, what happened was so i was uh, i was studying in sae school of audio engineering shout out to that's sae that's that's a really good school that's a very uh, i i don't know if it's good or not it's it's a highly reputed school by the way for those who are wondering it's actually pretty good now so uh, what happened was uh, like um sae they i mean and that during my time they told me to write a product review for one of their submissions okay so i just like uh, shout to nikon middle east again uh, cuz i reached them over i i know i know some people over there i reached them over i asked them can i borrow like a nikon d850 which was like one of the goated yeah cameras the... that came out at that time and they just lent it to me for like a week Nobody's going to do that here just saying. <laughs> and I shot Astro with it, I shot my friends with it, I shot the Diwali fireworks with it, I shot street with it. Hell. Fireworks are allowed there? No, it's just like they uh, were just randomly popping one off. <laughs> Fair enough. So, as another question I want to ask you which is who is the most creative person you've personally come across in this whole adventure? me uh personally creative and you've worked with them like i want to know that okay right 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 personally the most creative i've met i met suhasni ma'am suhasni suhasni ma'am from uh, mani sir's uh ah okay. this thing suhasni ma'am i met her on we had like this kind of like mock shoot okay and i saw her directing this like kind of like she was basically teaching the actors how to act but she was kind of also directing us so i was just like side i was assisting like i was like very on the side like like a fly on the wall types and then like i learned so much she was very calm like you know very very calm like you know she'll make the actors understand she'll you know like we explain what is missing what is not missing and then she'll and she'll just move very easily very gracefully and i learned a lot that day believe it or not and Fair obviously uh, i'm a die hard mani ratnam sir's fan oh okay yeah i love his guarantee some controversy in the comments after this and even actually more than that i'm a big fan of santosh shivan sir who recently won the peer anjani award in cans yeah that's uh, sorry i mispronounced it can so yeah. yeah so uh, like really cuz you know santosh sir has like some of the best work i inspire to do one day and they all seem big but then like they are actually pretty small at the end of the day they just people yeah right 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 so right. i want to know one thing since you've either directly or indirectly work with mani ratnam i want to know what's your favorite mani ratnam movie You seem to be a film buff. I know you're a film buff. Okay. So he's not he doesn't shut up about certain films in the office just saying so. <laughs> you might want to, this is going to be a long one. Yeah, that is true. Go for it. What so, is your favorite Mani Ratnam film? I would say my like most favorite Mani Ratnam sir's film is actually Guru. Yes sir. I Yes sir. That's that is honestly my favorite Mani Ratnam film as well. Yeah because the reason why I I know I actually didn't know this is not scripted I actually Yeah I didn't know that Yeah I know that was his favorite I never told him that was my favorite So See, okay Yeah I mean they say great minds But, think like uh, <laughs> Okay 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 let's not get too ahead of ourselves Yeah But I watched the Tamil version actually uh, I preferred the Tamil version mainly I'm because Hindi, I could right? understand He he knows Hindi I don't Hindi. I don't know I mean my Hindi is barely enough honestly but eh herat yeah ashiki jaga mat i'm 
I'm not the best vocalist, but come on. Same here. I, yeah, I, yeah, I yeah. sing I in mean, the shower. I sing same, the song same, in the same, shower. Man. That's like a yeah, very popular I'm, shower song <laughs> of mine. I mean, like, see, the reason why I came to know, like, why I have mad respect for the film because, like, okay, so shout out to Rajiv Menon sir, the uh, who's actually my mentor and also I've studied in in his institute, and um, shout out to all my other mentors, uh, Nyan Sekaran sir, uh, Guna sir, who taught me how to handle a camera, Sridharan sir, who is like really teaching me about like how the lights and all that stuff and. It's like you know. So shout out to all of them, and um, um, like that's a really like I. So basically, what happened was, uh, Guna sir actually one day called us all. So we knew that day we, we were going to have the breakdown, okay. And Guru movie breakdown. They told us mentioned it. So then we were sitting inside the uh, classroom, and sir was breaking down every individual scene by scene. What equipment they had used, how they had shot it, and all. And when I saw that, you know, like how they shot the song and all, no. So then I was like, especially those, uh, you know, the that. Dum tara dum tara jashn jashn tara dum. Yeah. Yeah. So that portion they shot it behind that uh, some kind of like uh, nice place, beautiful. I think Hampi or somewhere. I, that kind of this thing. Yes, yes. Yeah, so that was uh, so you know when Guna sir told me that that was shot in the morning, but then it looked like in the evening. I flipped. So that is a common technique, actually cheating to yeah. get that evening feeling, early morning. Yeah, it's a very common technique. Yeah, but you then just I, have to make sure that it's not too obvious that the sun is not in the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, as yeah, long yeah. as you can pull that off, it's just the sun's angle. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. when I, you know, when I heard about that, I'm like, oh shit. Like uh, why? I'm surprised I... because the people I work with are like, oh no, we don't want to. We don't want to cheat. There's some people. I don't, yeah. I'm not throwing shade, but I'm just saying, whoever who you, if you know who you are, you could have saved a lot of money doing this. Honestly. <laughs> yeah, like literally. Yeah, yeah. because. Um, I mean, these are pro tips. It's actual pro because pro if tips. I filmed this in the morning, we didn't have to you know, do it in the evening and waste you know, more time you know, and money. You know what's the insane thing that. They shot that you know like um, uh, Abhishek Bachchan walking on the like the top uh, in yeah, in, yeah, in yeah. Turkey. Yeah. They shot it with like a proper techno crane. Yes. And, and I was like, whoa! How do you get permission to let Amitabh Bachchan? Uh, sorry, Abhishek Bachchan walk into that frame first. Abhishek Bachchan walks in that roof, no Turkey. Yeah. Yeah. So how did they get permission to like land over there and walk over there? I'm like. Money, dude. If there's a big, I mean, uh, you know these these films have crores in yeah, the budget. Yeah, but then like right? you see the BTS of it, it'll be like only ten people chilling over there. I'm like, no, money doesn't. The money doesn't usually go there. The money goes into things like uh, permissions, uh, permission, and, yeah, and all, all that, that stuff. Yeah. So, for example, here in Chennai, the metro rail, how much do they cost to yeah, shoot, just shit. to even t- take. Two guys, one guy with a gimbal and a camera, and the other. You know, artist. you know, I have, you know, I have done that free of cost in Dubai, literally. Oh, they they are chill in Dubai. Here they're not. Here it's actually. I just, you know, what took my uh, D five hundred, put thirty five mm lens. My friends were sitting right in front of me, and you know that Abra that boat goes. Yeah. Yeah. So I was like, just uh, they were sitting on me. I was sitting on the same Abra. I was just shot them from the side like this, like this, literally. And you know, you could see that waves coming. That's the, the one I saw on your show reel, right? Yeah, thirty-five mm one yeah, yeah, four. Okay. Fair enough. Anyways, um, okay. Shall we take a minute breather? So there's a couple more questions I want to ask you, and one of them is: You said, and this is regarding to your photography that you've described. Right now, now you said that okay, every person who does f- photography would take pictures of something that matters to them. You were just going around. If I'm not, if correct me if I'm wrong. No, no, no. You that's were, true. You that's were true. going around just taking pictures of. Anything and everything. Your feet. Your uh, yeah. some guy taking a picture of something else. Yes, yes. Not that thing, but the guy taking taking yeah. a picture of that thing. You were ta- you were doing that. Yeah, but see, so the thing is, so what's your exact question about that? Why? 
Just why? Okay, so basically, see, for that, okay, see, first you take a lot of things. So, I think uh, who uh, I'm is it Brezon? Or I'm not sure who is that, but uh, no, Henry Cartier uh, Bresson. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I know his name is Henry Cartier, but yeah, uh, the, uh, I, I mean, can't pronounce his name last yeah, name. Yeah, either, so. exactly. So he, he said that your first ten thousand pictures will be shit. So you took ten thousand pictures just to make sure of it. Yeah, and I took more than that. <laughs> okay, then. Um, that is actually a pretty rational explanation. This is the most rational yeah, explanation that exactly. has come out of your mouth since you started being <laughs> in this company. So that's. Uh, I mean, like, I Kill. have a lot of philosophy, but if you ask for it only, I'll give. Fair enough. I probably should have asked. So, yes. can you list your all-time favorite movies, your top 10? Can you do a top 10? Okay, so, I'm, like, very fluid with my movie ratings. Very, very fluid. Yes, that's what I want to hear. No, no. So, like, I mean, like, my top 10 would be, like, my top 15 another 10 days. So it like just keeps changing every now and then. Like I don't have nothing like. Well, what's your top ten right now? Top ten more. Like right now, nothing of the past matters. Right now, what is it? Okay, so right now the top of the top, like out of the top of my mind, Oppenheimer comes because. But yeah, okay. Then otherwise there is Citizen Kane. Uh, that's there is actually Mank, which was like you know uh about the writer who wrote Citizen Kane. I mean, it's, like a, uh, it's on Netflix. It's on Netflix. Is it a biography? Movie no, no, no. Or? It's not a biography. It's like, it's, it's. I mean, is it biographical? It's not biographical. It's about the writer, right? Yeah, but it's not like about. It's just about some certain events that happened around it's that. It's related. It's related. You'd say. Yeah, it's related. Okay. okay. Yeah, it's. Uh, it's on Netflix. Mank. Uh, so that is also there. Then you have, uh, you know, um, then what else is there? Uh, you have Dune, 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 okay. Dune. Okay. And then like Joker. I mean like Lawrence Sher. I mean like, naam mein Sher hai. <laughs> like literally. Because I think Joker. I really liked uh, Joaquin Phoenix's acting in that. Oh yes. Honestly. I mean like yeah. Okay yeah. I literally like you know like I just love that mirror scene like in that bathroom he goes when after yeah, shooting yeah, that yeah, yeah, kids yeah, and yeah, he, he just yeah, has yeah. this like moment to himself. Yeah, it's like, yeah, yeah. It's like that's that's like heaven. Like in the just that pure few minutes of whatever you can see, you can see his entire life out of that this thing. So you are actually deep diving into this. And trust yes, me, this guy yes. knows his stuff. No, I mean like see so, I mean like let's just say he's able to analyze movies really well. So again, that's like See, analyzing movies is like analyzing photographs. One movie is basically what? One second of a movie is 24 frames per second. So 24 frames is what? 24 photographs. And 24 photographs is what? You're just like seeing a movie. Same thing. So Makes sense. treat it as one frame for 24 frames. So then you are, you have to kind of like see what is that emotion. That one photograph depth, no, when you analyze it, you're like, this side is perfect. No, that side is perfect. No, that side is perfect. Like... You have that small, small things, no? You focus on each, each, each layer, pixel by pixel by pixel, from the foreground to background. So like that, but you're just multiplying the amount of times you're doing on the on the movie. So you can get an understanding of like how you want it. Fair enough. I mean, like you should see my. You have seen my film, right? Short film. Yes, I have. Karakan. Yes, I have. Shot by my friend Ajay Kubur. Yes, I have. So, uh, I mean, like, it was directed by him, shot by me, produced by me. So, that's like... So, I mean, in that, I was thinking about all of this after what I learned. After so many years. I mean, it's vast, but then, like, you... Again, see, the more and more you do it, the more faster you get with it. And, I mean, like, okay, now, okay, everyone's, like, you know, they're just, like... I mean, I'm having, like, you know... uh rain down of like people in my life saying that this is not good this is not healthy but like you know um like what they're saying like they're like it's uh how do i say it i mean like yeah so the thing is uh, i mean they were just saying that <clears throat> 
huh, how do I say it's it's very frustrating you know it's like very frustrating because they're like how is this even like you know possible and all that stuff because I want to take my time with everything and I want to be like you know I want to make perfection because I I know so much so I want to make it perfect and they're like this is an obsession now and like I don't think it's uh yeah I don't think it's unhealthy to be obsessed honestly if you really if you really truly believe that that's the vision that should be portrayed and that's how it should be portrayed I don't think it's unhealthy yeah that is true see like so that that is my belief but then now you know the thing is I I I basically my mind outgrew my production size <laughs> fair enough so yeah so I mean I just wanted to be like the perfect most perfect image I can ever get that would be like 65 70 mm IMAX okay and sure yeah, good luck with that yeah but see the good thing is I want, I want like content which makes like you know so I mean mine is a very I don't know I don't know what my style is boss but I just say it like I just like seeing the truth like in the this thing like I want to I want to feel like you don't like cheating shots and no, no 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 I mean like see I do love cheating shots especially we are in time crunch and all but I've done a lot of them but yeah so I just want to like so I just want to shoot it how I feel it looks best okay I feel it looks best so if I'm given reading material I'll read it I'll see how it should feel like it should look best and I work off that then only like then approximately i don't want to like compromise on anything but i just want to make it look the best i can and make it like you know perfect but that's actually understandable and i i got no other comments on that but yeah so i mean like but no see the thing is like everyone they either want to do it all of this by themselves or they just want somebody to do it for them and when you're like yeah. trying to like find someone who can just like be like just like this just give me a handshake just be like this nobody's like either they're like they'll either pull you or they'll push you it's either that yeah uh, that. yeah so one of them and that one po- part will be like okay i'll do everything by myself uh, i'll buy everything uh, come okay uh, ready 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 uh, okay right ah uh, right 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 uh, yeah, i'm doing i'm hitting record uh, 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 yeah uh, okay i got my frame but i can't do anything now i'm dead that is one one mentality the other mentality is ah uh, you come you come you come uh, ready okay right uh, all perfect all perfect ah uh, okay ah uh, okay sure ah uh, okay ready ah uh, okay uh, action ah uh, silence 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 ah uh, okay uh, action ah uh, ah uh, okay I don't want to be either that. I'm like you want to be here, you be here, but be here. Can you do it? Can you work on that while being here? Right. Okay, that's it. Yeah, we can go. Yeah. Then, ah, yeah. Please do it this way. And okay, right. Yeah, that's it. Go. Everyone did their work. That's it. And no need for others to do anything. I'll just like I'll handle the camera myself and all. I'm more than capable of that. That's uh, yeah. There's two. There's two different mentalities. Yeah. So it's like the essence of control because I just want like that shot to look good, like you know maybe like add uh you know like little frames of like pockets of like maybe a table, a lamp, or something like that. Like maybe okay, think about like the thought. I think that's where I'm leaning to these days. I mean, what can I say? Uh, but yeah, so that's why none of like. I mean, I worked uh, worked as an assistant director, um, but I'm not like, you know, I'm not felt that. Maybe one here now that I'm here, I'm like really energized and I'm really like ready. Let's are you ready, bro? Let's go. He's even more energetic than I am. Yeah, and I got a lot and of I'm thoughts. I'm energetic, so. and I've got a lot of lot of thoughts. That's yeah, he's got he's got too many ideas. So. there was this thing in the office and we have an intern and then there's this guy so i was just taking the piss at both of them i was like okay i'll give you one hour just write a fu- right just i didn't even ask for like a script i said just write no, a short no he script. just wanted 5 minutes content 5 minutes content to write a short film. i don't i thought okay maybe he need little more than hour just like i was like strictly give him an hour and uh, see what they come up with i know they're going to i know they're going to fuck up but they're not going to do anything but 
Hmm. Okay, the intern. Uh, the intern didn't finish. <laughs> I don't even think the intern finished it. <laughs> yeah, so no, he didn't. He didn't. He didn't. In twenty minutes, he did finish it. He didn't. He did oh, not. He, he did okay. not. In twenty minutes, I don't have. I don't just have a story. I have a script as well. Entire For a five-minute short film. Everything. Yep, that's just me. Sorry. Okay then. Okay then. All right. I okay. See, like, so I mean, like, when writing my stories, I just like I think about it, write it then and there. Then if it's too long for me, I'll be like, okay, bookmark it here, leave it there. I'll come tomorrow. I'll remember it back. Start. Continue. And I'll I actually I don't have that persistence. Yeah, and I'll write like a novel, but then at the end, then I'm like, oh, I wrote it like a novel. I'll cry. But then okay, fine. Whatever it is, is the work. So I'll just like go and format that because that's how being descriptive should be. Is what you want to tell. That's it. So I want to ask you another question. Oh yeah, right. Go for it. Do you like to listen? to music obviously as a filmmaker you have to be into yes, music yes, you have yes, to yes. E- music has to be is a very important part of the process both on the job yeah. on the profession and in your personal life as well you know in your free time whatever you listen to on your headphones yeah whatever. that is true music is like a very integral thing like you know what see for me musically i don't have any taste sorry guys i mean, listen to anything anything like by anything anything so it'll be yeah, l- I mean, drum I'll, and bass up I'll, until I'll, like classical yeah, i'll listen to it dubstep I, to classical yeah if i i listen like to it indian to, classical yes i actually love indian classical to be honest i think i'm aware of that yeah and uh, i mean like i also like re- like i respect it being like traditional and all but uh, sorry guys i'm not a traditional guy so i like some of the fusion stuff i mean um, the fusion stuff is pretty good like i'll be real with you i am a huge fan of agam myself oh yeah 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 yeah, 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 yeah. i know see oh, we are pretty alike yeah i know them he actually knows <laughs> yes <laughs> okay well so you kind know how of. important music is in a film yes 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 score yes now let's actually start throwing a little bit of shade, shall we? Uh, okay, right, fine, 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 fine. This is a question I've always wanted to ask someone who's also in the field. Do you ever feel that sometimes a movie can have can be wrongly scored or the score, the music, the BGM doesn't sound right? For sure, but that will never get released. Anything that's released, have you ever heard? Something I mean, you've heard that's released. That doesn't fit the na- narrative and the mood of the scene. I mean, like, see, if you ask me, I would say uh, musically, no. Sonically, yes. Okay, just give us an example then. Sonically, uh, like, I mean, there is this, I mean, there was one film, I mean, I mean, sonically, like, yeah. So what happened was once I had, uh, I had sonic problems when I was watching in Woodland Theatres. That 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 speakers were like the worst. Ah, okay. That speakers makes like sense. literally fat guy, boss. So there is like a thing uh, that uh, there's a lot of backlash. There I'm, has been a lot of backlash for things like this. The biggest example I've seen, uh, and there's people venting on social media about this. Satyam Theater. Yeah, 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 you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. I know. How many times Satyam Theater has essentially fucked up no, royally but, uh, in no, terms of? No, that's not like you know the thing is. Wait, isn't that Satyam or was that like? No, I'm not sure which it one was. was Sat- it? Uh, some. I think it was Satyam, but I've seen maybe, some like, people maybe. prevent on the story. It couldn't be Satyam. Sorry, guys, who have yeah, anyone no, from Satyam not watching. To mean I don't know. Anything, but just like, but yeah. I'm just saying, I've seen one incident, incident no, in but You know, Satyam. Woodlands Theater, like, okay, so uh, I went there to watch. Oh, which movie? Talaparthi Padam. Ah, okay. Sorry. Leo. Leo, 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 Leo. 
I want to give my opinion in the movie, but... Uh, no, 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 no. I'll come to that later, but then... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, no, 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 no. Just leave that. Leave, leave, leave. I'll tell you that. Yeah, yeah, leave, leave, leave. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me. So, what happened was we went to like Woodlands and then they had like this messed up speaker, bro. Because like, they were like... Was it like crackling or something? No, it was like, it was, it was... It was just shit. And then what happened was it was on top of like the crowd, yo. The crowd, dude. the crowd in that my god theater dude everyone's like vj 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 and they're like ah talpati talpati whenever you so goes. essentially they're just screaming yes. and not letting you actually watch the movie yes see actually that's one thing i want to talk about and why it's controversial to be fair i also kind of enjoy doing that no, in theater some sometimes some people like like it some people like me who no hate i personally it. like it but i can understand why people hate it honestly Because again, you just wanna watch the movie. You can't watch it. When yeah, I can't hear like the dialogue or anything. Like you. literally, like I just, I just wanna watch the movie, man. Let me watch the movie. End of story. Like that's it. So go ahead, go on. So yeah, then we watched it. Then I found the film was like, eh, okay, okay. Why? <laughs> Never mind. I shouldn't have come for this. My mistake. Bye bye. <laughs> that's it. I like Gautam Menon, but. Did they just put him in there just because they wanted to give him? I mean, like, see, I mean, to be fair, like, I'm not saying saying anything wrong. I really love Lokesh Kanagraj. Okay, I'm a big fan, not really big I fan. I like but, Lokesh Kanagraj too. But I don't, I'm a it's very just, small, look, come medium on. fan. But like, see, the thing is that Leo, that Leo was just like, I'm over Leo. Away, isn't it? If only I had my. Christian name on my Aadhaar. <laughs> would have then I would have been cool. And the Mary, that's how it felt. No, no, I I meant the zodiac sign, Leo. Oh God. <laughs> oh, you meant it like that. Yes, le, yes, oh, Leo, shit. Leo, Arpa. <laughs> okay, I I I get that too. I see what you mean. Yeah. So that exactly. But see, like you know, my favorite of late recent movie. I mean. I don't know why I just love you know like watching series is like Jub- oh. Jubilee Jubilee yeah oh okay then there was that uh, then there is obviously Pony and Sylvan which was like Dude, cr- Pony and Sylvan I actually liked it I mean I understand why people are cribbing about the fact that yeah, oh my inaccuracies <laughs> my inaccuracies my and Gangu by Gangu by oh, oh my god I don't god. care I just like the movie bro Yeah I also re- I also am a history buff but at the same time relax it's a movie it's for no, entertainment Pony and Sylvan was like actually a very good film I would say it was it's like you know one of the biggest and best dreams of Tamil Nadu that ever happened I'm sincerely vouching for it and I haven't read the book surprisingly but still I read parts of the book but not the book I've listened to the audio book that's about it. Yeah but so like you know the way they sh- showed it like oh my goodness like you know I would like I'm like you know overwhelmed and especially that portion in that first film where Vikram just goes mad and just says that you know he was the one who saw Aishwarya first even though she's a wife oh my goodness like those places you know like it and he says that என்னை மறக்கத்தான் அவளை மறக்கத்தான் லைக் தட் தட் தோஸ் ஐ மீன் ஐ ஜஸ்ட் ஜக்ஸ் போஸ் தோஸ் டூ டைலாக்ஸ் ஆப்போசிட்லி பட் தேவ் சப்போஸ் கம் இன் ஃப்ரண்ட் ஆஃப் ஈச் பட் தென் நெவர் மைண்ட் சாரி கைஸ் ஐனோ தில் கில் மீ ஃபார் இட் பட் ஓ யா யூ கேன் கெட் மார்க்ட் ஆன் த ஸ்ட்ரீட் யா 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 பட் யா நோ சி யூ கெட் வாட் ஐ மீன் லைக் தட் டு பி லைக் வெரி லைக் யூ நோ he wants to f- i mean i don't know why i feel like i want to forget something but i'm not able to forget it but i don't know what exactly it is that i'm trying to forget that i want to do this entire process of because i've I, there are so many obviously yeah yeah see but like and i want to ask now what's wrong with all the mass movies you know now you know what i'm trying to describe with <coughs> So oh. like Leo Jailer see some no. of them are good like some no, of them no, no, are good no, no. but see, see, no see 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 it's ideally see the structure of mass movies are perfect okay like perfect it's just that you're just showing the same old subjects or the same old topics so it's just repetitive yes 
I mean that's pretty I mean, obvious. I mean you see what Rishabh Shetty did with Kantara right he just put that like you know one tail uh, one spin on it yeah yeah no that's 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 why kantara is yeah that yeah. that essentially it felt why different yeah and that's what like many people will again if they watch I, my show i i don't know why you heard like varurupam's like similarities with uh, yeah yeah the uh, navarasa yeah, yeah, yeah navarasa yeah. and varurupam similar oh my god i i don't want to get into that but no, i just want to like, bring it up yeah, that's a completely no. different thing yeah, so like that's for music for days Yeah exactly but no this show also includes a little bit of music cuz we are back pesla, to vanda ka pesla vanda ka pesla we are back to life See, i'm loosening up a bit as yeah. the show goes on so it's mainly because these two aren't here <laughs> yeah yeah so see i don't know if you noticed any jump cuts but those two have gone somewhere <laughs> so never mind let's continue uh, so what i was saying like see uh, in terms of that uh, music right um, like those are like different but they are like nice yeah yeah i feel the same too i look i don't care if it's a copy or color no, look, whatever the, the, see, whatever like, the legal dispute is let it get settled in court yeah exactly and you see like see okay, those those films those films those I, films you see the structure of it no like that film uh, kantara structure no it's like if anyone sees my short film they'll say that uh, i was inspired by kantara just because i shot it later no i wanted to do this subject way before Fair enough. Literally. No, my point is what I'm what I'm trying to say is I don't care if it sounds the same. They're both different instruments. Yeah. I like that as a musician. I dig that. No, it's just you can you can have your take on anything. Well, the movie was actually good. Yeah, it was good. It was not like other mass movies. Yeah. So so see, coming back to that mass point. No. So you ma- the structure of mass is great, but the way they like you know uh, topicalize it. No, is like honestly yeah. like. no no um, see you can have do good things in that structure itself you don't need to yeah. have to be the hero of everything yes heroism is not the only way there is more other ways no that's true that's true see actually my point is now i know the other ways but then now i no, kind you of don't, you don't have to do if you explain that somebody's going to punch you in the street as well yeah i just know them generally See, the reason why I'm making all of these comments is basically you know how passionate like all these superstars fans can get, right? Yeah. You know how like w- there was I don't know exactly, I don't want to get it wrong as well, but there were two actors like fan bases who clashed. One but of them I, died. I, like oh, the, no, during no, that no, clash no, some no. kid died. No, I don't know that. I don't know. No, that. it was in the news and all. Oh, really? Recently? Yeah, you can like look it up. I I, I not recently. This was years ago, but The, uh, the, uh, yeah, the the yeah the amount went to the uh, funeral to apologize so, and so, do so, whatever so, so, i don't know something so i see ideally again it's like you know what the fan bases of actors and all like see first of all that's like people's misconception yeah okay cuz i want to address that and say like people you are misconceived you have no idea this heroism is not that he's actually a normal person behind the camera is someone else he's one jolly person he's he'll, he'll just go sleep see, on a Very rarely do I actually find an actors are actual good people, genuine people yeah, 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 of yeah. camera. One example, may I dare say, is Sushant Singh Rajput. Oh yeah, he was like yeah. gem, gem. See, but then and that's the only only place where me as a fan, personally, as somebody who actually would be a fan oh, of these things, I would I, I would endorse actually yeah. like being a fan of him. See all of these people are paid to entertain you. Yes, exactly. You should get to that point. Paid, paid, paid. Just emphasize on paid and secondly, you know what? See they're just normal people doing normal things, okay? Who have, you know, normal lifestyles. They just get paid to do this stuff. <laughs> I mean, you can clearly tell Vijay is leading a good life. Yeah. You seen his house in Castrina Drive? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, yeah. that's got that's the biggest gate I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, so <laughs> obviously the biggest he doesn't want anyone looking into his house. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's that, true. No, that's a good thing. That's, that's a good that's thing. That's for obvious privacy reasons. Privacy reasons. But yeah, see, again, these people, see. So this is again what my mentor Rachi Menon, he said one day. He was casually like, just sitting with us like, you know, how we are sitting right now, and he told like, you know, these stars are just like they just look like stars but like if you remove that star this thing then they just normal people 
that is true and, uh, and i want to genuinely work with normal people i don't want to work with yeah. stars yes and i feel the same way because then there's the ego that the stars bring into the yes. set yes and that ego yeah. can fuck things up royally if you have fuck your creative process up royally and uh, see not just that also like see also on top of that you know what see um stars generally have this like you know they have this kind of like you know shady aura that goes around them and like you know you they'll have the like an entourage and stuff and i'm like why you're just coming to work do you have to come with so much see again cast up pose yeah just you come we'll give you everything khalas you come where go khalas stand uh, stand i just want to ask you what do you think of these like toxic uh, fan cultures that exist in our cinema scope you know cinema industry see, you know, see, cinema see, see, see 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 all of them basically everyone i am i'm a i'm a villain call me a villain i don't care okay you're going to beat up in the street for those comments but just saying but no see i'm just saying oh, can I, before you i'm going to get my ass beat on the street for saying this but you heard of the rumor that vijay is bald and wears a wig I mean I don't really want to know it also because <laughs> like it's just a rumor by the way but come on it's I, I mean I really do see I don't want to get into that topic also I just don't want to ask about it like let it live where it is okay Ooh. because I mean like yeah it's 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 a it's it's it's, it's his look ideally let him do yes, however man, he I'm wants. just taking the piss man come on yeah vijay sir if you're watching i do respect we you we love you we, sir i love you i'm just taking the piss man i'm sorry if you're insecure about that but mm. sorry <laughs> that, yeah that that didn't come off as <laughs> yeah. apologetic i'm so sorry <laughs> <laughs> no but no so but yeah the i mean like but the kind of barriers like you know kamal sir has been pushing technologically with the film industry oh my god it's insane it's in 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 insane like uh so like you know now with like indian 2 and all all that hype yeah so it's like can you imagine for one person to like he's now he's now essentially older so like you know like acting as an old guy is easy but acting yeah. as a young guy it's not who easy who is not aged I mean come on think about the amount of same thing with you know like you know the same thing in Bollywood like Shah Rukh Khan sir like sir big fan sir always swades so like if you'd seen that one film that didn't work of his uh, I mean it didn't run in the box office but it came out like a, it was a really good film it called Fan yeah it's a yash art film and you i mean they they released the bts video and i saw the amount of prep and the amount of you know like graphics and the scannings and the you know like all that you know processing and you know like previews and all that stuff insane like in freaking insane like getting markers right planning each each and every shot is like insane insane I mean come on Rachelle is truly really please see this I want to work with your company I have a script please <laughs> God actually yeah we we would appreciate it if you reached out to us yeah the, about of this channel yeah chances are they don't no but then they'll see this they'll see this hopefully they'll see this so yeah like really see because you know i one more controversial thing i will say is when something is also original yeah the chance of it not doing well in the box office because nobody really understands that's also great right yeah see that's also great but then see i mean like i mean like see sometimes you know what even i mean when we are doing it should be like you should plan it then because we don't know See, no, I'm not saying like I'm simply saying. Let's just say you have an original concept that has not been done before in film. Okay. Chances are no, it's gonna not gonna do well because again, people. So, so no, there's a thing in not in 
not in inter not other I'm, outside okay. india i'm saying i i i just might i can be wrong about this i can be no i very mean like the indian no 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 i think you're being a lightly bit incorrect cuz you might get some good audience it's not like you won't get any audience cuz like there are some no, I'm saying, really 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 like really like i would say like understanding indians who my i know see, personally see i have a fear though there's one project we're working on and the project's format is completely different from something that, that like and it's it's a complete it's, it's something that's only it's been done chaos. in it's something that's only been done in the us and are those countries right the western countries where there will humor can fly be an audience for this trust me he he is i was kind of like skeptical about no, who's going like, how we're going to sell this in this country you see, actually if it if no. you could give you reasoning actually it'll make me feel see, a lot better see see to see like these kind of things no it's like if you know how to get it into the people's mind about it then i'm sure they'll appreciate it so that's basically what marketing is and essentially if we market it we get it done fair enough fair enough fair and enough and we should just like go through those avenues which are like tried and tested in these waters so again everything is fluid guys nothing nothing really like that's you can true, mix stuff true. you can mix stuff literally fair enough fair enough yeah. i i see the thing what else controversial would you like to talk about honestly like i mean it's not controversy but i no, know no no I straight up want to ask you something controversial but I don't want to get beat up on the street for this. You know how passionate Yeah 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 I get people's you. People's fans are Yeah. No tell me. I'm 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 actually not going to ask that big it's I you know what it is this is the Vijay wig thing it's on my fucking head. <laughs> it's in my head now. <laughs> Does Vijay wear a wig it's in my head. I'm not going to ask now, him that. I'm not going to answer that. No 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 now this actually feels like oh, Okay, all right, this It feels good. like improv. This feels like improv. I mean like you oh, know This question is improv and we didn't script. Yeah. Yeah, I know right. So exactly improv. So I mean I watch well, a lot of comedy. I watch I <laughs> I do watch c- comedy. Comedy is also one actually, of Actually, what them. is your Oh yeah, that actually I want that gives me a question to ask you. What's your who's your favorite stand-up comedian? I would say the marvelous Mrs. Mezo. Stand-up comedy? Yeah, it's a show about a stand-up comedian. That's on Amazon Prime. I have not seen that actually. It's actually very funny because it's like it talks it takes you to about how a housewife essentially who has a very good com- comedic sense because oh, yeah. st- Alex Bostein isn't that right? Yes, yes. Family guy is Lois yeah, Griffin's yes, voice. Yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. Oh shit. And that, and th- that was like you know like I saw that I'm like oh damn this can also be a possible and you know they shot it like exactly true to like 1950s 60s New York. Like you can actually see that. Only thing it'll just look more pink and like you know bright and bubbly because it's like uh, they. What they do you think of the TED series? The TED, the Talking Teddy Bear one. That, no, that shit. Talking Teddy Bear one. I just he just did it because he's like us. It's just a guy. Ah, I'm paitya. Yeah, I'm exactly. Paitya. Panid lah. It's a guy thing. So it's like you. Can, I just need a uh, five crores for VFX. Yeah, exactly. So you just see exactly. So I know if it's done by a guy or if it's done by a girl. I'll say I can tell. patakla yeah. can somebody can somebody really like bankroll us 5 crores and we'll do this yeah we'll do something like this <laughs> we can do something we fx ro kutterla we'll make a talking we can make what? this like a lot of thing talking what what's a, what inanimate object should we make talk i mean for india the best inanimate object would be chai Thank <laughs> 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 you. Yeah, you said with a chai da. No. A talking cup of chai. Yeah. How would that work? I mean, every guy just You just taking the shit out of your ass on you. <laughs> okay, fair enough, fair enough. How about like the chai no, thing no, no, is come like Come on, come on, come on. Got something else. Come on. You know, but actually they made one uh, this thing. uh one film with uh, street dogs or something it was called roadside romeo or something by yrf about in i think oh yeah i, think I heard yeah, that yeah, i didn't yeah. see it but i heard of it i saw the film i saw the film oh, how was, was it it was, i i i love the music on it like the music on it was like crazy they scored like the actual street dogs or like trained uh, no 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 they it's all actor. animation da oh all animation at that time 
Jugal Hansraj was the voice. I think yeah, it was him only. Yeah, I think so. Dude, I heard. I didn't see it. I don't know what the fuck. Yeah, it's like it's crazy. It was at that time when animation was like still basic and all, but this is like the shadow stuff and all, like Shrek stuff basically. So it was like two D animated proper, like no three D. Three D. Proper three D. I I gotta see this man. I gotta yeah, see like this. it was like it was like. It was like YRF. YRF had done that. Actually, no. It was actually Aditya Chopra, like literally, because he's the the does this. He's he is the guy who did DDLJ, by the way. So I mean, go figure. So I'm making myself look like an ass here. I just know a lot of things, man. That's it. Fair enough. Don't have to gloat. <laughs> I mean, like yeah, truly. But okay. Uh, <laughs> but yeah so he made that film that was like a really beautiful film i don't remember the what the film is about i just know it was like maybe like i think a street dog falling in love with another street dog and they had like a whole rescue operation kind of thing i don't remember exactly but i get in the gist so uh, wait why does that remind me of uh, bolt yeah it's kind of disney film yeah it's not like bolt but it's more or less like you know Uh, Indian spin on that kind of thing, but not Bolt has superpowers. This like normal street dogs, normal Terunai, and it was very interesting, very very, and the music was like so good. I remember because I was like in who was the composer for that? I don't remember. I was a kid. I was like in fifth grade or something. Oh, is that old? Yeah, I was that old. Wow, but I remember. Good oh yeah! Memory. Did you hear that they're making a Mexican remake of Three Idiots? I, I mean, like just watch it in Hindi, boss. And I'm like, Hindi, it. okay, Hindi is fine. Why are they doing it all the way there? No, I mean, it's like, for see, them. no, see, I mean, like, the concept is great. They could, if they apply, take that concept, it's apply. It's a short for short remake, I think, right? Is if it it's a short for short, short remake. Is it? No, I no, don't. Somebody told me was I haven't seen the trailer yet. I don't. Think I'm going to watch it after the show, and if it's a short mm. for short remake, I'm bashing my head against this wall here. Yeah, exactly. No, short for short remake for sure. No, because if they are like you know restructured it to suit their cultural this thing, then yeah, it would be great. Fair enough. Because again, see, this has that Indianness to it. You know that family sentiment, brotherly sentiment. You know that college crowd sentiment. It has see Indians fuse sentiment with everything. Americans, you don't. You clearly don't. No, don't even try. No, the amount of shit you're doing, no, don't even try. Europe, okay, you're some like some. You're that weird guy in the this thing. You're the weird guy. And uh, oh, damn, do, you just roasted all Europeans. Good luck. Uh, <laughs> See you later, European viewers. Bye bye. You, I know you're. I know you're clicking off of this video to watch um, no, Tom song. Scott. Rest in peace. Yeah, he he retired. He didn't die. Yeah, but no. See, but Southeast Asian, like, yeah, no, their shit is like great. There's like straight up next level, dude. That's like you. S- they they're like given that you know there was this like recent video in Apple. They shot everything on iPhone, and it was like inspired from manga. They did in Japan. It was amazing, by the way. That shot, shot on, on iPhone. Yes. They actually shot this on iPhone. Damn. Okay. Yes. I mean, now that pretty much iPhone 15 has come out, then. What was the shot on though? Fifteen. <laughs> That was shot on the fifteen. Yeah. I think fourteen or thirteen or uh, this thing. This is a fifteen, by the way. So just a heads yeah. up. This is my fifteen. He. What do you have? Mine's a thirteen. Sorry. Uh, It's okay. He, uh, my phone's in my pocket. His is not. No, but I'm I intend on using mother's phone now that I'm here. No. Yes. I'm not giving you my phone. I will rig that shit. He really wants to look stuff up. Yes. Wing it, my guy. Wing it. <laughs> no, I will really take it from your pocket and rig it out. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not. You're not. You're not getting. Come on. So yeah. Shut uh, up. Uh, okay, so I think with the fourteen or thirteen, there's this like there's one alumni. Okay. Uh, he did it with uh, Vishal Bardwaj sir. Okay, and they did it with. Um, I think they did it with. Uh, Ishan Khattar and Mamika Gabi. If I'm not sure, I don't. And uh, it was about uh, a guy falling in a time loop, and that was shot on the 13 or 14, I think. And they had like a whole BTS of it. And the DOP was Swapnil Sonane. He's actually my alumni, and he's an ISC, proud ISC. 
Indian Society of Cinematographers. I want to be. Please accept me. Fair enough. Fair enough. So, yeah, he's from our institute. He did that. So, I'm like, wow, I can do that with. I mean, they shot in Jaipur. They shot in. They shot in like a virtual studio kind of like thing, and it was like crazy, crazy. They shot in a train somewhere. Believe it or not, some toy train kind of thing. It was like I think the one that goes in the Sahara, that one. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. They even shot a Amazon Prime show in Jaipur. Believe it or not, it's called Bandish Bandits. Do you see actually? Have you seen Bandish Bandits? No, I've heard of it. I, I haven't yeah. seen it. Yeah, no, I play the music all the time. That stuff. Yeah, that, the shit Bandit. that you were playing today. No, 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 no. That was just Pony and Selvan. Oh. No, Bandish Bandits is like classical fusion type series. Oh, okay, okay. No, I know, I know which music. He doesn't stop playing music. I tell him, look, you want to listen to music? Play on your headphones. D- I have headphones yeah. for a reason. But I just like listening it in true audio quality. Don't either. bug the people working around you in the same no, office. No, but it has to be listened to that perfect audio quality. Send us the link. We listen to it on our time. Not hey, man, not every headphones, uh, you know, is like stabilized to the perfect balance of your ear and all. We have a standing rule. If somebody is not comfortable working with music, don't just don't play music. <laughs> he doesn't respect that, and he Dad. also he. You I mean, need to also keep your hands off of my stuff in the fridge, okay? <laughs> Seriously, for I mean, fuck's sake. That is, that is there. I'm gonna bonk you on the head with this. <laughs> I'm the guest, so next show, Madhav. Next show. Next show, Patikla. Yeah. After, next show. Actually, after this, after the show is done. Yeah. We're in the writing room. Yeah. I'll bonk you on the head. <laughs> Let's see that. Okay. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. So, uh, that's what. So Please don't be a dick to your co-workers. Whoever works in an office here, please don't be a dick to your Play co-workers. Play music. Enjoy shut, life. Shut up. Shut up. Enjoy life. And enjoy do not life. touch their stuff in the fridge. <laughs> if they have something in the fridge and it's theirs, take it, ask take them. Take it. Take it. Ass. <laughs> take it. Take it. Take it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like literally take it. He's actually going to get his ass kicked when he gets out of here. <laughs> all right. All right. So, I think uh, are we done or no, we can continue. Damn, we still got a lot more. Yeah. What's the time? Time. <laughs> the time is isn't even a question in this. It's just go with the flow. Enjoy, Madhav. I'm going with the flow, but I'm starting to feel sleepy because it is late right now. We're recording this pretty late, by the way. No, I mean, it's fine. You know what? Like, you know, the thing is, I just, I can talk forever, ideally. But, yeah. Mm. I mean, last we were talking about that Bandish Bandits show. Yeah. So it was like a beautiful show. Actually, no, adding to that, see, I want to tell you one thing. I'm a huge fan of this show called The Grand Tour. Oh, I Jeremy love Clarkson. that. I love that. The way that's something. I want to no. do something like yeah, that one day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And I, not even just a motoring show, like an adventure show. You know, adventure. I loved it because when... You know, I loved it when that, that other guy was there, no? Uh, Richard. Richard Hammond, yeah. Yeah, Richard Hammond, he just drove that uh, that car, that one, the, that car was there, some... Rimac, yeah, he drove that Rimac right, right into Right off of the... <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's <laughs> fucked up. He nearly yeah, died. <laughs> but What's I like, wrong with you? <laughs> I like that. <laughs> like, he's going... Psycho- right Psychopath. Psychopath. <laughs> what I'm the fuck is wrong with you? You fucking psychopath, bro. I mean, that looked fun too. Dude, me. this this fucking show started me just going, trying to follow like whatever script these guys were fucking telling me, and then we're just going <laughs> off the fucking rails. Good fucking pilot episode, by the way. <laughs> yeah, it's like legendary now. Hey, hey, strike hey, or hey, then also, you know, I also like that show where they like thought that you know a Datsun one couldn't beat a Porsche. That the boy yes, that they, 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 yes, 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 Super Safari. yes, yes, dude, I know that one too. <laughs> yeah, so oh, yeah, uh, there is an episode of the Grand Tour where they take a tracked vehicle, right? Yeah, uh, yeah, what yeah. is it called again? I don't know. Oh, shit, it's called a, a JCB or something. No, it's not even that. I think we're running out of battery on our mics. No, 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 anyway. it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Yes, we are. I think we are running out of battery on our mics. Hey, man, pace sure. No, I'm not stopping. I'm just, I'm not stopping. I'm just saying we're running out of battery on our mics, duh. Yeah, it's okay. See, no. My point is, what was it called? 
it was an American company which makes tracked vehicles for military use, and then the civilian. It yeah, cost three hundred thousand pounds. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They went and got it like some kind of tank or something. It's black color, right? That yeah, I- yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I I don't What's the name of it? Okay, I have to go watch for... the episode after this and check. <laughs> let's just skip forward, skip See, forward. See, I I want what I want to know is dude, the amount of detail that goes into filming that show. Keep in mind there is there's B-roll shots. They're shot completely separate. And yet they go so seamless with the show. Have you seen that? Yeah, yeah. For yeah. example, I mean Clark like since st- doing a piece to camera and immediately cuts but that is not any camera car is not for, like during the piece to camera he's just driving and it's just him and the camera yeah, and the I audio think, no, setup no, no, no. i think they have like actual cameraman over there no no during the piece to cameras they just give the car to jeremy and they just send go around cameras all rigged remote everything oh. recording is in the car and then the uh, and then they do the same thing again going around with a camera car tracking that, them that that actually takes that's a, lot of, a lot of effort because see that's a lot like of the, effort that the amount of planning on that is like and insane the planning pays off because you should see the yeah. quality of stuff that comes yeah, out of like, it it's, it's like, seamless yeah. It's like, oh my god, next level. Auto car India has no sh- nothing on nothing, this. Nothing, nothing. No, uh, JK, I like you guys, but let's no, be but real. no shade. Literally, no, nothing. Like, no and I do watch auto car. By the way, I'm a yeah. vehicle. Into- I have a vintage Jeep, dude. Come on, I'm I love his Jeep. I love his Jeep. It's black. I, it's like it that. reminds me of my Nissan Pathfinder. Uh, not uh, RIP. You had, you yeah. st- is it still there or you sold it? No, I, I resold it, but I don't know. Like, okay. I hope it went to a good place. It's a gulf. It's going to end up either in some rich guy who's going to crash it eventually or scrapping it. I mean, yeah, sure enough. Fine. Idum kadan the pogum. But before uh, the Grand Tour, there was um, something or Top Gear, obviously. You yeah, know. Top That's Gear, obviously. Where yeah. they all met. You know how, like, <coughs> obviously a lot of the inspiration, even from. Uh, they are uh, spin-off shows like Clarkson's Farm, yeah, James yeah, yeah, Mays, yeah, yeah, yeah. and uh, Our Man. In, oh, you remember uh, those magazines? Those Wheels magazine? Those those were some fun magazines. Oh, yeah. The covers were like... I mean, like, see, guys, if you are into visual stuff, please, you know, keep auto cars as one of your genre. Because, like, I mean, honestly, inspiration can just come from anywhere. Trust me, you guys want... Autocar, music, F1, engineering, science, business. But business. I want to ask you something about Clarkson's farm. Yeah, yeah, yeah you sure. seen the show? No, I haven't seen. You should watch it. So, Top Gear I've has seen Top that Gear has li- like little emotional structure to the show. Meaning, by emotional structure, I mean like it's something you can basically like watch one episode of yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, Grand Tour or Top Gear. I'm like, okay, fine, whatever. Next no, week, but you whatever. know, like, I've just seen. I'll get my beer and I'll watch. Okay, okay, okay. Just uh, sorry to interrupt you. Cause tell me, tell me. Hot take. I just want to do a hot take. Sorry, guys. I'm doing hot takes. Yeah. Hot takes. Oh, boy, here we go. Um, What's your thoughts on the coffee couch? Or haven't you watched Coffee with Karan? If I say anything, I'm going to go to jail. <laughs> Let me just say that. <laughs> Let's leave it at that. I'm Let's not just asking. leave it at like that. No. <laughs> For the safety of this YouTube channel, this company, <laughs> me and him, I'm not gonna say anything. Yeah, yeah, Trust yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. Sure, I, sure. I'm not gonna say anything. Sure, sure, sure. I, my mouth's shut on this one. Okay, right. But back yeah. to what I was saying. No, but then again, so like similar shows around that. Okay, like for example, have you seen that? Like, uh, wait, but what's your favorite talk show? Like. No, um, it's I didn't talk. That kind of yeah, yeah. I know I have one. None I, of I fucking hate Fallon. I, I have, hate Kimmel. I I, I just Conan's like all right. I like I like Abish Matthews by the way. Abish Matthews does this like talk no, show. No, Indian no. No, international. Other than India. No. Um, okay. Well, I just watched randomly Jimmy Fallon. Sometimes I'm not really a big fan. That's really bad. No, fuck Fallon, man. I just like watch Abish Matthews. And I don't care if I, I throw the shade. He's too big. He's not going to give a shit about what I you say. You know, I actually met Kanan Gill. Okay, then. Okay, fine, fine, fine. Fine. I got a photograph with him. My it's my phone is not here. Sorry. And you can't open that on my phone, so. Yeah. Eat shit. <clears throat> no, I'll show it to you definitely after this. Fine, fine. No, see, <sighs> can I give you my pick? Graham Norton Show. Actually, yeah, 
I like that show. I've just seen like a few. Can videos. I tell you why I chose Graham not in show over yeah, every yeah, other? Yeah, sure, 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 sure. Because that is that guy. That's the only show I've seen where nothing is scripted. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Jimmy Fallon, everything's uh, Kimmel, everything's yeah, a yeah, fucking scripted. teleprompter. Yeah, yeah, There's yeah. There's a structure. Kimmel asks the questions and the answers come in. No, no, no. See, see, no. see, see. No. Wait, 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 wait. So you know, like Jimmy's like so. I mean. Uh, Jimmy feels like you know that eighties television show. That's the that's old. It's the only thing I can say. Is, oh, it's too hey, look. It's an outdated format. Yeah, it's it's essentially yeah. an outdated format. But NBC, yeah. fix your shit. But fix your shit, please. See, no. But my point is, Graham Norton actually has a good conversation with his host. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like you can see, his host can actually open up, loosen up on his show. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true. See, because there you can see like, if you watch Graham Norton show. First of all, the biggest thing you'll notice is Saraka Vepanga. That is for sure. That is how actually, you know, everyone should get loose. No, I by believe. the way, by the way, it's not the same drink. It's a different, different drink for everyone. It's everyone. Agents will call, obviously. Preference. The personal preference of the artist is laid in front of you. Yeah, Your and that's choice best. of alcohol. I mean, like, see, I would have had a preference tonight. First of all, you know how fu- you know how fucked it is to even show alcohol in Indian cinema? Um, we can't even, you can't even show Maduk, that shit. They are doing a lot of... No, uh, you show that shit, it's, you have to put the... Censor, yeah. I know, yeah, that's... See, again, so... It's like a taboo here. <clears throat> yeah, no, see... That smoking... You know, you know, see, the thing is, these people, they are... India is a bit conservative in nature. Oh no, that's a, that's a given. That's a given, yeah. So again, when you come to that kind of thing, like you know, you see, like essentially, what they have done is like um, associated like like alcohol and smoking and essentially into like culture over there. Like they've like infused that and they're like it's okay. Keep in mind, Graham Norton's Irish, and you know how the Irish <clears throat> are. If you're yeah. talking stereotypes. So like it's it's in 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 mixed with their culture and it's like. They they're not seeing this as right or wrong. They're just seeing like it's okay, and here it's like there's no it's okay. It's either yeah, it's like either, either you have fun or you die. By the way, have you seen Graham Norton's like commentary of the Eurovision? No, I have missed that one. Dude, dude, no, you should actually watch it. It's dude. If you want a quick laugh, just watch uh, the Eurovision with Graham Norton's commentary. Okay, I just get my laughs out of Abish Matthew. Trust me on this. Watch it. Give oh, it a and shot. you know, by the way, Zakir Hussain. Zakir Hussain like this most insane comedian like I've ever seen. There are two Zakir Husseins. One is a comedian and one and is the, a legendary tabla uh, player. Tabla player. Uh, sorry, not Zakir Hussain. Sorry, my bad. Zakir Khan. Shit. Wait, seriously? Yeah, his name is Zakir Khan. Shit. Zakir Hussain is like my I'm favorite. I'm not cutting this. I'm just gonna leave it in there. Yeah, that means I love Zakir Hussain too much. I love him. He's okay, a. You he saved it. You saved it. Yes. You saved it. Yes, I love him too much. He's like, he's like one of the god of tablas, and I love tablas. He's the god of tabla. Yeah, I know. Yeah. I do. That's can I, I do that. act, Yeah, Madhav can like you know just like you know he can. Approve I'm a musician. This. I can actually. I actually can tell. No, he can know. approve this because like I only play Zakir Hussain most of the time in the office. No, I'm serious. First of all, the only fucking thing if he plays music like out loud, and the only fucking thing he plays is Zakir Hussain. Yes. Like the rest, twenty percent of the time it's other stuff which I was talking about earlier. But yeah, eighty percent of the time it's Zakir Hussain's like, like performances and yeah. stuff like that. It's like it is. It is okay. Fine. Okay. I mean, I'm weirdly wired. That's it. But yeah. So like yeah, and Zakir Khan's comedy. I love Zakir Khan's comedy. Zakir Khan's okay. like this insane comedian. Fair enough. Fair enough. Talks about life, enough. reality, and he talks like to this hey, really. Uh, Ricky Jave. Ricky Jave, no, I. You don't watch him. No. Okay. I I recently Russell did. Peters. Yes, I've seen him. What do you think of Russell Peters? I rather watch the Jonas Roast. Damn, bro. Damn, damn. Or I just watch Fluffy any day. What do you think of the Comedy Central roasts they do? I mean, like. We should do one of those one day. Isn't that what we're doing right now? We are not exactly <laughs> yeah, dunking okay, on each fine. other. We went from asking questions in an interview style podcast to just dunking on. I wouldn't say this is. A yeah, no, no. We're just like, 
having fun with our thoughts whatever the fuck the vibe is honestly yeah. guys this is only a pilot episode by the no, way we don't even know how, how this is, is going to go this is how we want it to be coming in the future but just like talk about stuff yaar talk about life I mean like sorry it's I, I, first of all full disclaimer it is actually it's been a while since I've hosted anything and I must say Madhav you make a great host like really great uh, host I don't know why I took the break in the first place but we're back exactly and so I'm back at least and, and chances here. are I'm going I know <laughs> chances are I'm going back into the shadows and I'm probably going to do another show uh next episode onwards you're going to see this guy yeah as that's the me host. he's going to ask the more the technical questions and have some fun there yeah i'm just here to get the pilot episode off the off no, the ground yeah i mean like you still did have fun right didn't you why not so yeah so let's uh, have if mo- anything it gives me motivation to be- come back and host stuff yeah so exactly so yeah so works. let's so yeah so <clears throat> you know off late i'm just saying like you know the I just like I want to I want to make something which is on the scale of like a Gangubai or a Hira Mandi, but I want it to be more accurate, factually sound. If you know what I mean. Why not? But just get somebody to give you three four crores and three four crores won't cut it, bro. Oh fuck! I shouldn't have spoke then. Yeah, it's going to be like a lot, lot, lot. No, but I mean, like you get the vibe, right? Okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, <clears throat> uh, what's your favorite movie? I forgot to ask that. You're interviewing me now. I mean, like, yeah, because you seem to be running out of stuff to say. Yeah, it's kind of true. That's kind of true. What's my favorite movie? Oh God, this is. A- Yeah, that's a, that's that, that 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 is a pretty hard one. Okay, say what's the most like recently watched film? Um, I don't know how to. Hold on one second. It's this one. It's this one. It's the it's got Buddy Valo in it. That's the most recent, and I rewatch it for like the third time. Um, Have you seen? Oh, okay. You're, yeah, you're a musician, right? You're a musician, and you're. Uh, hold on, it's uh, this is the movie I saw. Nagaram Marupakam. Nagaram Marupakam. I haven't seen that film. Ah, uh, features Sundar, by the way. Sundar. I haven't. I haven't seen that. You film haven't seen that. That's, that is one hell of a, a comedic film, by the way. And oh. I like comedies. It's oh. on Hotstar. It's free to watch on Hotstar. Oh, uh, right. You gotta go through the ads for that, though. But you get the point. <clears throat> yeah, that it's is a, true. It's a. You I mean, have, you definitely seen the. Comedy parts on YouTube definitely. It's one of a lot of you guys yeah. watching. And no, Deepa, I liked you know I liked the, that film. You know which film? Ah, uh, that uh, uh, Chandramukhi. Ah. I Rajni sir's comedy in that bro. Rajni. Uh, that's one thing we don't talk about. Rajni can actually do comedy pretty yes, damn yes, well. Yes, 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 yes. That is like like that's the thing. He's not just a superstar dude. He's a pro. He's not not that va- he's mass just, superstar bro. He can actually do comedy well. He can act. Have you seen his like? That's the thing. His old comedy movies, yeah. bro. His old comedy is like brilliant, amazing. So I mean, yeah, I wanted to bring that up essentially, and like you know, it's it's like and also you know, see those old style comedies like something was lacking today. I say. for there of a better aspect or better way of wording it i feel the way same way yeah and also like i mean no shade to any of them um, uh, but the comedy scene isn't like i mean like it's not the best not the best in terms of films yeah rest is fine stand up stand up fine stand up is fine. like amazing stand up we got a lot, a lot of stuff of coming people, in a lot, lot of people lot coming of in I mean, like we can do stand- new people. I uh, want to do stand up actually. Show idea. Yeah, I want to do stand up. I don't know. I'm just. Patilam, Patilam, we'll. I'm just, anyways, you know, like just telling. So uh, basically, you know what I do is uh, I I tell all my secrets, Madhav. इधर पन्ना आधे पन्ना आधे पन्ना Madhav like पनीला बस पनीला, and I'm just like okay done cool कबीस we can do it. Hasn't given me a bad idea yet, I mean. I mean, my ideas are basically what I want to do, so that's how. Then what? We're in sync. Then what the fuck? There's no fucking bad ideas. What is that a bitch about? Yeah, there's always great ideas, but if, see if those great ideas don't turn out good, then we can blame ourselves for it later on. But then. Ah, the upper one path. 
but when a good idea turns like you know like you put the effort into it and like you know you take care of it and like you nurture it it becomes great and that's how like a lot of my like inspiration has been okay like you take care of it like literally and i'm sorry i'm going to spoil the second show for you guys but then like i'm just going to reveal the name of the guest who i'm planning to bring on i mean if you don't mind i wouldn't do that Okay, right. Secret is secret. Is a secret. Still a secret, guys. Still a secret. Come on, next show. Next show, uh, we have someone very interesting. I mean, very like, very interesting. Okay, I'll just give a brief, like, okay, like, give a hint. Just give a yeah. hint. Yeah. So he's a guy who wears many hats and he knows how to do a lot of things. And he's been there, like, he's kind of one of my inspirations, in a way. And he's and I worked with him also. And man, the gene, he's a genius. Man's a genius. I don't know if I am one. That. not only you guys can tell me i mean soon you will say we are just putting the efforts for that work hard and work harder and that's all just like you take the idea you run with it, it works or doesn't work eh pathakla that's like next level is there's always give yourself beep 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 oh i have to talk now no i didn't say that you You didn't understand what the beep was for? Ah, that's fair. Just figured it out because I'm falling asleep. I don't know if you guys can notice, but yeah, god but damn dude, it's late. This is a pilot episode. We just wanted to give it a shot. But then the conversations are coming very nice now. Varto, varto. But come on. How, how much battery do we have? I don't think I can. We have like a lot. We have everything left and plus some people are still here to be back. Ah. he's going to take a while yeah so we have to wait yeah. for him right now let's cut it off like that why we kind of have to not really my commitments there at home where you're going na veetukku poi idu pannum da idha camera la solla mudiyadu seri okay say so, okay let's just give it our last 10 minutes and just, just yeah. i'm going to fuck let's out of get the fuck out of here yeah closing commentaries any look, anyways guys look this is a new show from i we're working on and, yeah. uh, and this is just a pilot this is a pilot this is a pilot that's why we're kind of having fun with it but but you can genuinely expect the same type of goof somewhat goofiness but you're going to have you're going to have the same fun conversations on the next actually, episode actually those will be more to be. technical and yeah, topical more cuz yeah. we are going all over the place honestly yeah and i mean like there's there's from lot of fields of visual uh, departments uh, like you name it photography filmmaking you can have even architecture you can have actors you can have there's so many other things i have planned out costume designers this that blah blah, blah. so many things and uh, yeah and so now i am at throwdown media i am the coo chief operations officer and i am the ceo for those who don't know and i don't think anyone has ever seen my face on cam well welcome because to the world for a while yeah no because uh, my older projects are like uh, yeah. long time ago on like as a host if you follow me on imdb you probably know Yeah. Actually, wait. No, this is not the first time I'm on, I'm on cam for this. Sh- yeah. For this channel, I have acted in a short film. Oh, right. That I produced in, the, which is on the other, oh. which is on, which is on another. With technically, it's on another channel, but it's same brand. So. Yeah, but yeah. So same yeah. thing. So yeah. So he's the CEO and the COO. It's more like we're partners in this kind of like this. We're in it till the end, kind of thing. Don't touch my coke in the fridge, bro. Please. <laughs> okay, right, 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 right. Do not. Okay, then, <laughs> then yeah. Um. So yeah, and I'm the creative director. So I'm curating a lot of stuff and planning a lot of stuff and thinking a lot of stuff and. Uh, imagining. A lot of stuff, obviously. I'll say that. Yeah. So yeah, now I'm here. and my instagram socials is like it'll be down below it will be in the description adu yeah. paathikalam yeah my socials will be there his socials will be there this channel so social social is, don't everything worry everything will be there and yeah i mean like 
Thanks for doing this at very random. Guys, guys, actually, this is this whole recording was impromptu. Chances are, it's, it's not but even it going to be. Good. Yeah, it looks good. I like the framing on this. It and looks great. Looks different than what we've done before. So hopefully, yeah. uh, even for the next season of music videos, I do plan to change the framing and location up a bit. Yeah, so, so there are a lot of changes also coming for that. A lot of changes coming. A lot up, of guys. projects. Of projects, we've acquired a new studio location as well. Like yeah, it's like right location. down, right down. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's a big area as well. We're gonna do like we're gonna have we're gonna do a lot of things. I don't want to reveal too much, but uh, yeah, there's a lot. Basically, of stuff in the we works. just like we are now in that. So we are in the phase where like we have the ideas. We just want the genie in the bottle yeah. to open. So anyone whom we reach out to or who want to reach out to us, please reach out. To we'll do everything. We'll take Pana. care. You we'll just come care. with your what doubt you have. We'll figure it out. What we'll you want, it we'll figure out for you. Yeah. Anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna leave it there, and we're gonna leave it here. Yes. With you guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Do stay tuned for the next episode of Back to Life. Yes. And with me. With this, he's gonna be the host. By the way, Aditya's the host for the ne- for the next one onwards. Yeah. I'm just here to start the pilot, and. Um, more to come that's for sure and thank you guys so much for supporting us through all of this through everything do subscribe do like this video and do turn on notifications to know and when follow we us everywhere follow us everywhere yeah everywhere. obviously all right bye